G'day, you're on live. Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for tuning in today. I'm still continuing on with this old 30-year-old um, Sony unit. This is the Sony HRGP5. It's a 30-year-old unit. It was released in 1995. I've done a couple of videos on this and a couple of shorts as well. But what I really wanted to show you guys today was some of the awesome stereo effects in it. Now, bear in mind, this is 30 years old. So it has... A cool stereo delay in it it has a cool auto pan and some modulation as well as uh, some reverb so uh, let's get started that first one you heard is actually the uh, stereo delay if you haven't got headphones uh, go put some on Just enough. So without it, I'm absolutely dry as a dead dingo's donger. Turn it back on. And it's glorious. It sounds lovely. It's a digital delay, of course. But of course, being a 30-year-old unit, the chips that are in it are not full... You know, um, uh, digital chips. I mean, they are digital chips, but they're not able to hold the fidelity of your guitar signal for as long as modern chips. So there is some actually, there is actually some degradation there. You can hear them sort of get more and more muffled as they tail off. I could talk about stereo delays all day, but I'm not. I'm going to move on to the next one, which is the auto pan. If you haven't got your headphones on, now is a good time to go put them on. This absolutely does my head in. The auto pan goes from left to right. All it does is just pan your signal continuously from left to right in a circle. I think I've sped it up a bit there. Anyway, that's the auto pan, it's pretty basic. Be really cool to feed a synthesizer through that and check it out. All right, on to the next one. All right, this next one is the digital chorus. See, while I'm going, the amp sim and the drivers are all coming from this uh, Sony unit as well. I'll put some reverb on. So without the uh, stereo digital chorus. That's pretty cool. This next one is the stereo flanger. Oh, 
you, I'm hearing some top end go from one side to the other. That's a really lovely flanger. There is uh, quite a few controls there. There's actually four different pages that you can scroll through there. I'll have a look here. One, two, three, four, back to page number one. Wow. So you've got heaps and heaps of control over that. All right, the next one. Type. Phaser. I mean, sorry. Yeah, phaser. Now, after years and years of hearing all these effects in mono, just in bedroom rigs and here in the studio and stuff, it's really interesting to hear Sony's take on these effects in stereo. They sound great. Ah, that is awesome. That is the stereo phaser. <laughs> Uh, this is the Stereo Ensemble Chorus. Too. Now this next one is the rotary. It is stereo, but I'm pretty sure you need the foot, the plug-in foot controller for this unit to make it speed up and slow down, which I don't have. I can hear some slight modulation from left to right. I'll just have a quick play around with the controls to see if I can make it go faster to make the stereo field more obvious. All right, I've worked out that I can change it from fast to slow on the machine and it will sort of ramp up. Have a listen to this. So uh, it also has a ratio control, which is pretty cool because you can change the ratio of how many times the tweeter speaker spins compared to the bass speaker. So have a listen to this when I turn it up, how much faster the tweeter speaker goes. <laughs> Thank you. 
Well, that is super duper, so, super duper awesome. This unit is 30 years old. There is some of the stereo effects there, but they're the ones that I found. Uh, the reverb is also in stereo, but it doesn't have a very wide spread. Nothing like the uh, auto pan or the, uh, you know, the dual ping pong delay. So I hope you enjoyed that. If you're a synth guy or a guitar guy and you're looking for some uh, nice lush stereo effects, effects at a very, very cheap price, they're literally throwing these things away for like 50 bucks now. It's got an Amsim builder. There's a whole heap of videos on our channel now uh, featuring this uh, half rack unit. So uh, go check it out for yourself. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Give us a thumbs up, like, subscribe. It really helps our channel out a lot and we really appreciate your time. So uh, thanks for joining us. We'll see you in the next video. Bye.